Why, hello, internet. This is the root. Oh, don't need this. I got a bit of a disappointing, well, short, not long term announcement to make. And this happened when I was just about home, roughly about two to two and a half kilometers away. The axle on my bike broke. The wheel came off and I got dumped off. Pretty much. I'm okay. No scrapes, no bruises, no fuck all. Like how it's not ripped. I wasn't hit or anything. It just broke. So, until I get the rear assembly, or until it actually arrives, I've already ordered it. Or did I? Yeah, I did. I'll probably be without it, without my bike for about 30 to 40 days in total. Yeah. Sounds miserable, doesn't it? Yeah. Well, I'm just thankful because the wheel kept wobbling. Even worse, even worse, indicating it was the axle, not the wheel, because the wheel doesn't need to be true. I verified it. It was the fucking axle. It was cracked. And I had no fucking idea why or how that happened, but whatever. Guess it was a defect, maybe? Well, anyways, I'm just glad it didn't happen when I was going on the way to work down Ellis Road, if you know how steep that hill is. I could have been in the hospital, likely dead, if it had have, uh, broken off. Thankfully, that didn't happen. Thankfully, that only happened when I was just about to get moving. It was a green light at Osler and Davenport. I got fell off it, obviously, because it fell onto the right, because the right wheel came clean off with the axle intact in it. I gotta get that out of there. I also gotta take the basket off the damaged rear assembly. Yes, it got damaged, because, yes, the wheel came off, blah, blah, blah. The wheel's absolutely fine. I had to walk it balancing all the way home from there. It wasn't that difficult. Uh, and... Lucky I wasn't in heavy traffic for the other part. The motor simply waited for me to uh, strap the wheel on the back of my basket and uh, move the bike onto the sidewalk. Because shit happens, you know? So, uh, yeah. This sucks. So, I had to wait for one. I gotta wait for the rear assembly to arrive. And two, I gotta walk the crippled son of a bitch to the shop, because yes, it's crippled. And no, I'm not gonna tear it into a two wheeler, because I cannot balance for shit, to be honest. And, uh, three, uh, I'm only gonna have to pay for the labor, luckily. And a few other things to get corrected on it. I may have to bring it to another place, but hopefully, this one shop will be able to do it and get it put on. At a reasonable amount of time. And until then, I'll have to fucking buy a Metro Pass for the time being and get the scooter out of storage. I gotta contact the super. Hopefully, the uh, super is available tomorrow. I hope. Then, well, I have to be patient and wait. As a result of that, I'm probably gonna end up getting fat, which happened before, but luckily, it's Hopefully not. It's not going to be six months. Six months! So, hopefully I don't have to wait six fucking months. It's likely not going to be that long. To get it done, it'll likely be about 30 to 40 days. A month and a week? Or two weeks? And then I'm back on the road again. I had to postpone or cancel all plans to film time lapses. There was three coming up that I actually planned to do. I can't. It'll be next to... It'll be very miserable to actually strap a tripod to a shopping cart or whatever and wheel it around. Not to mention it's not the same. The bumps won't be able to be absorbed the same and it'll have a lot of fucking noise. That's going to be difficult. 
Anyways, I'm safe. I'm okay. I'm not hurt. That's the best part. My bike, it obviously needs a new rear assembly. So, that's the only thing wrong with it. And currently, it is propped up because I can't do fuck all with it. Alright. No, this isn't a short, obviously. I just thought I'd make a video about this because, obviously, when your main method of transportation breaks down, it sucks. It doesn't matter if it's a car, a bike, or a mobility device, or yourself, if you end up dislocating an ankle or whatever, things suck when that happens. And thankfully, I do not live in the middle of nowhere. I'm very thankful about that. Otherwise, yeah, I'd be fucked about getting to work in that. So, by tomorrow, I gotta purchase a Metro Pass. After I get the scooter out of the locker. Yeah. Alright. Thank you for watching. Peace out. Feel free to subscribe. And if you want in the comments, uh, tell me about uh, your transportation horror stories and uh, what you did as an alternative substitute or blah, blah, blah. Until it was fixed. Peace.